Morning guys, uh, just want to do a quick video here about being thrifty when you shop. Um, we hear a lot as an excuse for not eating healthy that it's expensive. And for the most part it is. Um, for example, last weekend I bought my first box of <clears throat> gluten-free pancake mix. And it was maybe 12 ounces, and it was $4. And I believe the regular stuff, got this gigantic bag, was something crazy, like 64 ounces. And I think it was like $3. So eating healthier can be more expensive, but not always. If you guys saw one of my earlier videos, uh, sometimes I wake up late, I hit snooze too many times, and... Um, I wake up late, I got about a 20 minute drive to work, and sometimes I don't get my lunch made the night before, you know, uh, for varying reasons. We're, right now we have five kids and uh, until my sister-in-law moves here, and uh, her kids go with her, but, um, so we focus on them a lot, and kind of put ourselves second as far as the extra stuff. You know, I have a healthy meal at the time, and when I can, I make my meals ahead for the week. But um, I discovered at the grocery store, just on the other side of the freeway, that they do a three-item meal for $4.99. Um, I get two pieces of grilled chicken. They do have the bone in, but the bones aren't very big. And I peel the skin off. Um, and two sides. You can get greasy JoJo's and potato salad. Or you can get stuff like yesterday I had uh, apple... Waldorf salad, which had apples, grapes, celery, a couple other things. Sounds like a weird combo, but it was actually really good. It was my first time trying that one. And they do a crunchy vegetable salad, a kale superfood. And yesterday I got the crunchy vegetable salad. And uh, a giant bottle of Dasani for a buck. So normally that's 604. Uh, in Oregon they charge a five cent deposit on each can of beer, soda, and they just started doing water to encourage recycling because if you turn those bottles back in, you get five cents per bottle. And that's a real popular thing with the, <laughs> with the homeless people around here is they go around and pick up cans and then they take them and cash them in because since someone else originally paid the five cents, they're getting the five cents back from someone else's bottles and it actually generates money for them. Yeah, five cents a piece, it takes a while, but when you're homeless, I mean, what else do you have to do with your day? Anyway, well, here at work, we keep a bin of uh, recycle bottles too. And every so often, I go and cash them in. Either I put it back towards buying a case of water for the employee fridge because we all drink water here uh, or if I already bought water with my own money then now when I recycle the bottles I'll keep it for myself well yesterday I was a little low on cash and I hate running my bank card for you know stuff that's less than 10 bucks but I just really don't have a lot of cash anymore um, so I took the bottles and I cashed them in. It took me about 10 minutes. I got $4.65 back on my bottles. And I got, so I got my three item meal, and my bottle of water, which was 604. And you deduct the 465. And I paid, you see it there in the pink, $1.39 for my lunch yesterday. And it was healthy, healthy, healthy. So. Do some research, find some places around you that might sell stuff a little cheaper. Uh, and it's really worth the effort. Uh, $1.39 for two pieces of chicken, two sides, and a bottle of water, and an extra 10 minutes of work. I'll take that any day. Anyway, I just wanted to share that with you guys. Uh, do some research, find places that sell cheap stuff, make it happen. Remember, set those goals. Kick him in the face. I got to get to work in three minutes. Open this place up. So I will talk to you all later.